Cleveland Cavaliers superstar LeBron James refused to comment on the claim by Blake Griffin that he will end up with the New York Knicks rather than the Los Angeles Lakers in 2018. In an interview with TMZ Sports, James replied, I don't even know what you're talking about when asked about the pronouncement made by the Los Angeles Clippers forward video before driving off in his Porsche. During the View from the Cheap Seats podcast last week, Griffin said James might join the Knicks rather than the Lakers when he turns free agent after this season. Griffin added that James and his group of guys, referring to Chris Paul, Carmelo Anthony and Dwayne Wade, are brewing something and they're going to try to make that work. Earlier, James, Paul, Anthony and Wade have planned to play together in one team at some point in their respective careers. One possibility that it could happen is with the Knicks, where Anthony is currently signed right now. The Knicks can make some roster changes to create room for James, Wade and even Paul, but they have to agree to a massive pay cut. Paul can leave the Houston Rockets after the coming season. Wade, for his part, could get a buyout within the next few months from the Chicago Bulls. James to leave Cleveland after this season It was reported that James will leave Cleveland for the second time in his career after his relationship with Cavaliers team owner Dan Gilbert has turned sour. According to longtime NBA writer Chris Sheridan, James' relationship with Gilbert is beyond repair and the superstar is 100% leaving the team in 2018. He, however, reiterated his commitment to the Cavaliers for the coming season, saying he will not exercise his no-trade clause. James is expected to join the Lakers in 2018 and team up with young guns Lonzo Ball and Brandon Ingram. Paul George out of Lakers equation Oklahoma City Thunders Paul George was also reported to be joining James with the Lakers in 2018. However, George's plan will change if the Lakers are found guilty of tampering. The Indiana Pacers accused the Lakers of tampering with George before they traded him to the Thunder for Victor Oladipo and Domantas Sabonis. The NBA recently started its investigation into the charges by interviewing the Lakers' front office, including team owner Jeannie Buss, president of basketball operations Magic Johnson and general manager Rob Palinka. According to Adrian Wovnerowski of ESPN, the investigation will zero in on Johnson's possible impermissible contact with George.